Hello, this is D, and I'm back with another video. Well, you're watching Ratchet and Clank here on the PS4 Pro in HDR. Now, the camera that I'm recording this with can't pick up HDR, so on YouTube, you're just going to see it in SDR. But the reason for this video is a lot of people are having problems with HDR on their PS4 Pro and it not being displayed properly on their 4K television. Now, uh, for this game here right now, I have it set at automatic, and it is going to 422 chroma subsampling, which is wrong. HDR10 is supposed to be at 420 chroma subsampling. So right off the bat, we're getting wrong information. Now, I was investigating further and I went into my receiver to see the exact information on the video. And I'll show you guys here. So as you can see here, we're in 422 chroma subsampling, which is incorrect for HDR10. It should be 420. But the interesting part is that it's saying 24 bit, which is eight bits per channel, which is eight bit color. Now, uh, HDR is 10 bit color. It's not eight bit color. So this is why, it's, if you can see up in the sky box there, that I have some banding. And some people are also reporting banding on their televisions and that when they're switching it to uh, YUV or the chroma subsampling of 420, that the, um, the banding is going away. So I'm going to switch it over to the proper settings that it should be at and I'm going to let you guys see the difference. Okay, now I've manually switched it to what it's supposed to be, which is uh, YUV 420 in the PS4 Pro settings, and you're having the proper chroma subsampling now of the game. Now, if you can notice, I don't know how it's coming across on YouTube, but you should see that there's no more banding up there, that everything looks a lot more clearer up in the sky. But the interesting part is that when I once again click to see the information of this video, as you can see here, of course, we're in the proper 420 setting, it's at 36 bits, which relates to 12 bits per channel. So we're getting actually 12 bits of HDR at the chroma subsampling of 420, which is still incorrect. Uh, HDR is not graded at 12 bits. It's graded at 10 bits commercially right now. So I don't know why the PS4 Pro is sending a, a 12 bit signal to the television. So I don't know, once again, the settings for PS4 Pro and HDR all, are all over the place. Um, the automatic setting doesn't work the way it should, and the manual setting is putting it into 12 bits. So I don't know what's going on here. They need to push an update out. I don't know if the developers need to go in and patch their games so that they're outputting the proper HDR settings. But I can confirm, and this video should confirm, that HDR settings are a little all over the place right now. But uh, I recommend to put it to YUV420 if you're getting any banding. If you don't have any banding, then I guess you can leave it at automatic for the moment as these HDR HDR settings are not correct and they need to be tweaked and hopefully Sony will push out an update quite soon. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.